Since the early days of humankind, man has been driven to discover new things and develop new technologies. Just like how the wheel was once a novel concept, it is now necessary for one's daily life. Many new technologies will become commonplace and essential in a few years. Recent developments could possibly revolutionize multiple industries. These groundbreaking findings have the potential to change the world. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be taking a look at three incredible new discoveries. New AI is better than humans at redistributing wealth fairly and equally. As artificial intelligence technology continues to develop, there is growing speculation about the future of AI and its impact on society. According to one study, AI may actually be better at distributing wealth than humans are. This study, conducted by a team of researchers at the AI company DeepMind in the UK, found that machine learning may be better at designing a fairer society. One hurdle in this task is the concept of value alignment, which means results that humans want. What makes value alignment difficult is that humans rarely agree on the how of creating a fair and prosperous society. They are not often on the same page about politics, economics and society, among other things. According to author and research scientist Rafael Costa, one key hurdle for value alignment is that human society admits a plurality of views, making it unclear to whose preferences AI should align. It's difficult to determine which views are better for the greater good. One method the researchers developed to combat this conundrum is creating an agent for wealth distribution that keeps in mind people's interactions in its training data and then aims the artificial intelligence's decisions toward the human preferred outcomes. While many people view AI as completely independent, this mechanism would actually not work as well without the feedback of humans. It needs human feedback to point the neural networks to a better decision. In the team's experiments, which involved thousands of human participants, an AI agent called Democratic AI studied an investment exercise in which the participants received money that they could contribute to a public fund and then accept the returns from their investment. In these games, wealth was distributed amongst the players in four different redistribution methods – liberal egalitarian, libertarian, strict egalitarian, and a deep reinforcement learning method called human-centered redistribution mechanism. HCRM uses the data from the human participants and AI agents to mimic the behavior of humans. Interestingly, the HCRM method was the most popular of the methods among the participants, even in comparison with the more traditional redistribution paradigms. While the findings of this study are fascinating, there were some things to consider when applying the results to the real world. For example, would the players have trusted the AI to make redistribution decisions over humans in a real-world setting? According to the authors, their results do not imply support for a form of AI government whereby autonomous agents make policy decisions without human intervention. They reiterate that their research should not be seen as a method to overthrow the current system but as a research tool that can help humans create better solutions to the problems we have now. One thousand microbe species have just been discovered in Tibetan glaciers. The Tibetan glaciers have long been considered extreme to say the least. The Tibetan plateau is characterized by freezing temperatures, solar radiation and limited food. This hardly makes it sound like a comfortable place to spend time at. Despite these conditions, scientists have discovered 968 species of microbes. The discovery was aided by the Glacier Ecosystem's first dedicated genome catalogue. According to the research study team, glacier surfaces often contain diverse life, including bacteria, algae, fungi, archaea and microeukaryotes as microorganisms are able to adapt to extreme conditions. Glacial microbiomes often provide a timeline of microbial life on Earth as ancient microorganisms have been revived. Researchers wanted to study the Tibetan Plateau, not in spite of its conditions, but because of them. The region has also been greatly affected by climate change, with more than 80% of its glaciers affected. The researchers stated 
that the findings were particularly timely as the glacier ecosystem is threatened by global warming and glaciers are retreating at an unprecedented rate. For this reason, time is of the essence when studying the microbes in the area, as proof of their existence may soon be eliminated by climate change. At times, extreme efforts need to be made in hostile environments in the search for answers. In this case, the level of effort the researchers put into studying these microorganisms is extraordinary. And it paid off. 82% of the genomes found were novel species. The researchers have begun calling the project the Tibetan Glacier Genome and Gene Catalog. According to the team, the TG2G catalog offers a database and a platform for archiving analysis and comparison of glacier microbiomes at the genome and gene levels. Japan to drop world's largest turbine into the ocean to harvest energy. Japan is planning to install the world's largest turbine in the ocean to harvest energy. This turbine will have the power to resist ocean currents and then convert the flow into incredible amounts of electricity. The prototype, named Keiyu, was created by Ishikawa Jima Harima Heavy Industries, a Japanese engineering company that has been doing tests and experiments on the technology for over 10 years. In 2017, they united with the Industrial Technology Development Organization to realize their ambitious concepts. In February of 2022, the team was able to successfully complete a three-and-a-half-year test off the coast of Japan with Keiyu. Keiyu is 330 tons and 66 feet long. It can locate the best place to generate power from the current of the deep waters while it is anchored to the floor of the ocean by power cables. Of course, designing Keiyu was no easy task as the creators had to keep the chaos of the sea in mind in its design. The ocean's waves tend to be turbulent, so Keiyu has blades rotating in opposite directions to keep it as stable as possible. Up until now, Japan has relied on fossil fuel imports to generate the tremendous amount of power the company needs. After a highly publicized nuclear accident in 2011, public opinion on nuclear power turned negative, and there was more encouragement to develop renewable energy options. According to IHI's predictions, if the energy from the current is harvested by the turbine, it could create enough energy to power the entire country. However, attempts to pull out energy from the ocean have mostly failed. Some of the many hurdles this project will have to overcome are environmental restrictions, the high engineering costs and the accessibility of coastal areas. If IHI finds success with this project, it will no doubt be a game-changer. Scientists are making incredible discoveries every day and we can only imagine what will be found in the future. We've highlighted just a few of the most exciting findings from this year, from the possibility of creating an energy resource that can power an entire country, to creating a genome catalogue, to creating AI that can solve the economic unfairness that exists in the world. But what do you make of these discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below, and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.